Hello, my name is Max, and what I'd like to go over today is how to install Lumbutu 20.04. This is a LTS uh, version, LTS standing for Long Term Service, which means that as of 2022 or 2022, this Lumbutu ver uh, version will be good for security updates up until 2025. So let's go ahead and start with the video. What I'm doing today is I want to install Lumbutu 22.04, as I said, onto this computer. This is a very old computer. Um, it, it won't take Windows 10, let alone Windows 11. This is an old uh, Lenovo T430 laptop. Um, I'm gonna open up a command line and let you guys see the um, see the hardware specs. Uh, in order to open up the command line on this uh, on this on on Lumbutu 20, 22.04, you can do it one of several ways. You can come down here to the bottom left, left click on the start button, and then go to the system tools, and then from here. You go down to where it says Q terminal right there and then you just left click on it. The other way you can do it is is on your keyboard for your laptop. You should be able to push the buttons Control, Alt, and T. All three of those at the same time. That's T as in Tango. And that brings up your command line or your terminal. Whatever you want to call it. So I already have it up right here. So if we type in this command, neo fetch, and then press enter, you'll see the laptop specs here. And this is the version we're installing. And this is the laptop we're installing it on, a ThinkPad uh, T430. All right, so moving on, in order to install Lubuntu on this system, what we need to do is we need to come over here to the left. You'll see as I have it right here, it's highlighted it says install Lumbutu alright also before you do that you want to make sure that you're connected to the internet okay that way you can go ahead and get your uh, get a majority of your updates you'll still have, have to update once it's installed and you log into it but this will help you get um, a majority of them anyway so in order to install it, you do one of two things. You can either re right click on, on it with your right mouse button, then left click on open, or you can double click on it with your left mouse button. Either way, we'll start the installer. And as you can see right now, we're installing it now. Right down here at the bottom, you choose whatever language you want. Obviously for me, I'm gonna choose English and then you just wait for it to start there it goes and then down here on the bottom right you just go ahead and choose next choose your area for me I'm closest to New York so that's already in there I'm just gonna go ahead and click on next and on this next screen you choose your keyboard layout mine is English US and then you click on next and then from here you can choose where you want to install it obviously for us we want to install it on our uh, hard drive I got a 300 gig hard drive here or 320 gig I believe is the total amount and then you can choose either you want to erase it or do you want to do a manual install for us because we're going to use all of the hard drive for this operating system we're going to choose erase disk All right and then we go down to the bottom right then we click on next and then from here we go ahead and we put in our username and our our password information I'm gonna put down here customer and then I'm gonna put in the password and then they want you to repeat that just to verify that you put in the right password and then you click on next on the bottom right hand side 
Then it's going to give you a general sum summary of what you've chosen for your settings. Once everything looks okay to you, go down to the bottom and click on install. Left click on install. Then it's going to ask you, are you sure you want to? Because once you do this, you will not be able to undo changes. We are going to go ahead and choose install now. And that's it. All you, the installer does the rest from here. It's just going to go through and it's going to um, install all of your uh, all of the software or the uh, the operating system for Lumbutu. And so that's it. The reason why I chose Lumbutu is because it works very good on older systems. Like I said, this is a Lenovo T430. I'm not sure when the release date was for this, but it's got to be at least more than five to ten years old, if not close to that that time period. But uh, Lumbutu seems to be working very well on it. Um, I installed it on some older machines uh, a while back, so it seems to be working pretty good. It it does a pretty good job. So after this after uh, this is installed. It'll prompt you and say that uh, it's done with the install. Do you want to reboot now or continue uh, testing out Lumbutu? So that's basically it. Um, for, like I said, from here, it should be straightforward. You should be able to, to take care of it and the rest of the install from here. So that will be the end of this video. I will be uploading this video on both YouTube and Facebook. So, when and if you get a chance, please like and subscribe. Thank you very much for looking at this video. I hope you guys have a good rest of your day or night. Thank you. Bye-bye.